Hi friends, welcome to Sri Sai IT Hub. In this video of Core Java Programming, we are going to discuss the following topic. So file class to verify either file or folder. So we are going to take a name from a particular file or folder and we are going to verify that whether it is a file or folder right so first of all we'll have a small revision what is io streams in java io so io stands for input output then what is stream so stream means flow of data from source to destination in a java program now basically in java we have two types of streams First one input stream and second one output stream. So what are input streams? So input streams are nothing but reading streams. So they will read data from source to Java program and generally the source is keyboard. And next output streams. Output streams are nothing but writing streams. They will write data from java program to destination and generally the destination is monitor or output screen or display and to work with io streams in java program we have java.io package now in this package we have different input stream classes different output stream classes using which we can perform reading operations and writing operations in a java program now coming to the concept of file class so how to use file class to verify whether given name is a file or folder in your directory so now file class is available in java.io package and next file class is neither inherited from input stream class nor output stream class but still it is a part of java io streams and java.io package then what is the use of this class so this class is used to work with files and folders just like operating system files and folders for example we can go for file attributes like read only write only or hidden files we can go for file or folder paths their names check whether it is a file or folder so now we are going to check whether a particular name which is given in our program is a file or folder who is the parent folder for that and then create folder and files deleting folder or files etc so same like windows explorer operating system we can work with files and folders from java program so coming to constructors and methods which helps us to work with file class so if we issue this command java p hyphen p java dot io dot file open the command prompt and give the command right so in this class we have many methods to work with files and folders so first of all file class it is not inherited from either input stream class or output stream class but still it is part of java.io package and java io streams so coming to the constructors so this is the constructor for which we have to pass the file name as parameter and for that file we can work with file attributes file name file path etc and then this is another constructor for which we have to pass the file path first parameter is file path and second parameter is file name so path plus file name it will become a complete absolute path of the file and we have different methods like exist we can check whether a particular file or folder exists or not 
and after that we are going to use these two methods is directory to check whether a given name is directory or not is file to check whether a given name is file or not right so now these are the two constructors and then exist is file is directory so let us try to demonstrate this with a small program so the program name is file class example 6 so let us take the comment first so program to use file class to verify for either file or folder so take a new page write the comments and import the package so take the main class with main method so the main class file class example 6 save this program in our working directory so save it as file class example 6 dot java so program execution starts with main so since we are working with io streams and files we may get io exception or file not found exception so let us put try block and then followed by catch in the last so catching any type of exception and printing exception type and message so let's go to the try block so here we'll give enter any file name or folder name you can give any file name or folder name so that name we are accepting with read line method of data input stream class object so create an object of data input stream and pass system dot in which indicates keyboard so we are going to accept one line of input from the keyboard using data input stream class and whatever the file name or folder name we have accepted okay so we'll take that as f name string f name file name or folder name and this f name we are going to pass it as a parameter to file class constructor and create the object so now we are going to check first whether that particular file or folder exists or not okay so if f name dot exists if else so in that situation we'll print a small message here system dot out dot print ln file or folder exists so this is the initial message otherwise file or folder not exist so we'll write it as given file or folder given file or folder exists right so once it is existing we'll check if f name dot is directory so if it is a directory then we'll print a message given name is a directory given name is a folder the folder otherwise we'll check for one more if condition multiple if condition f name dot is file so if it is a file then we are going to print given name is a file so this is what we are supposed to do it whether it is a file or folder right so save the program go to the command prompt right. compile the program file class example 6 dot java right so cannot find symbol exists okay right so let us try to rectify what is this error right so f name is the name of a file what we have accepted from the keyboard but here we have to use ff object which is file object so ff dot exists ff dot is directory ff dot is file Let's save it clear screen recompile right and let us try to 
pass file or folder name from our working directory d colon core java probes. So if we go to this directory, we have different files and folders. For example, so in our working directory d colon core java probes, we have copied files pack1, pack2, sci. These are folders and we have different files a.java, p.java, different files, etc. Like we also have text files also like demo files, demo1, demo2, demo3. These are some files. So let us try to work with this. So let us give copied files. So given file or folder exists, given name is a folder. Next, pack1 exist. it is a folder. Okay, next give sci ram. So folder exist. given name is a folder. So this is a folder which is available as a subfolder to sci ram. It is a folder. Right. So next, we'll give some files names also. Something like demo1.txt exist. Given name is a file. Like something like demo2.txt exist. It is a file. Okay, let us give something like hello. So given file or folder does not exist. Not exist. So this is how we are supposed to work with file class to check for existence of a file or folder and then check for it is a directory or a file. So that is what is all about file class to verify given name either folder or directory or file. Thank you for watching this video. Do like, comment and share this video. And also subscribe to the YouTube channel Sri Sai IT Hub. Have a nice day.